I know this is a bit late, but the new Incredibles trailer dropped two days ago, and here I just want to discuss the best and worst of the trailer. Starting with the best. Jack Jack's powers. Ever since the last movie, we've all been curious as to what Jack Jack powers exactly were. Well now we are finally getting to see them in full swing. Jack Jack is teleporting all over the place, shooting lasers and stuff. And from Mr. Incredible's visits to Edna Mode in the trailer, hopefully we get some more insight into what these powers exactly do. And hopefully we get to see Jack Jack fight in the final battle. The new battles. From the brief frames in the trailer, we can see that the team will be going up against some new villain, yet to be named or seen. But we can see that once again, the team will be working together in a similar fashion to the previous film. We can see Violet using her new powers to a much fuller potential, Frozone returning, and some cool shots show that this movie will be really, really great. The animation. I know that the characters obviously look the same and that the animation style hasn't changed at all. But just looking closely, we can see that the animation is so much more crisp and nice to look at. The colors really pop and honestly make the trailer that much better to watch. Over the years, the animation has been progressing to amazing standards and this is no exception. I have no doubt that the movie will look amazing. Now moving on to the worst. As usual with a great trailer like this, there isn't much that is worse about this trailer. There's only one thing I could really think of. This was a separation of the normal and super lives. In a movie like this, it can be hard to show both the lives of the supers and the lives that they have behind the scenes. From the trailer we can see that there's a lot of behind the scenes stuff and not much super stuff. It seems that the story is really focused around Bob being at home with Jack Jack and the teens. From this trailer there's a clear distinction between the normal lives and their secret identities. This isn't necessarily a bad thing, but this could result in the movie dragging on in areas that we don't want it to. Hopefully this is balanced out by the fighting and battles at the end. Two months left till the movie releases, I can't wait. That is all for this trailer, if you liked the video please like and share, and until next time.